Welcome to today's meeting. Please not make your speech to the council. You should not take longer than five minutes. And by beginning by introducing your group. Good afternoon, Lord Mayor and fellow councillors. My name is Mark Barrow, and with me I have Tom Raper. I've been underwater filming in Yorkshire's rivers for over 30 years and have real concerns over our rivers in Yorkshire, particularly the river wharf with plastic and raw sewage. I am seeing more and more plastics and garbage entering the river systems from businesses and the public, which in turn will have devastating effects on the life that depends upon the river. Not so long back at Weatherby, a van tipped its entire contents into the river and after phoning the EA they said it wasn't their problem and to phone the environmental services at Leeds which then made me aware that it wasn't their problem and again passing the book. It resulted in myself and friends clearing the river out with me putting the diving gear on. The wipes and plastics travelling through the river system is of major concern too as with many rivers in Yorkshire. I regularly film plastics and wipes and garbage flowing underwater unseen and have started documenting this within the last two years. I do try and clean up what I can but it's obviously impossible on my own and we need to try and get the general public and businesses to start caring more. Another point concerning me is raw sewage. Not so long back raw sewage was being pumped into the River Wharf at Boston Spa and Weatherby. And councillor David Hopps did an article raising questions as to whether the upgrade at Weatherby Treatment Plant was actually up to the job. These events of sewage entering our rivers are in non-storm conditions when the river is low. And in fact, at times, storm collecting tanks can be completely empty. For me, this is totally unacceptable. My concern is how much of this sewage is passing through Weatherby where toddlers paddle and play. How much of it is affecting wildlife? I have filmed in underwater in these areas where sewage enters and trust me it's extremely shocking and devastating along with being extremely un unpleasant when an outlet pipe opens up on you. Right across Yorkshire we have huge amounts of plastic waste, tons of it entering our rivers and it's generally revealed after floods have taken place plus the raw sewage entering our rivers. Yet we look at environmental issues abroad and look in shock and horror at what is happening, yet in our own backyard we seem fit to destroy what we have and literally turn a blind eye and accept, accept what's going on. Water quality, I'm told, is better than the Industrial Revolution times, yet you wouldn't have to do much to improve on that particular time. Water quality is way off the mark at this moment in time, and can the public and council work to improve this and start to eradicate plastics and sewage entering our rivers and is it possible for Leeds City Council to pave the way to a new beginning and to set the benchmark for other councils to follow despite the uphill battle that we do face. Our rivers are the arteries of any country or county or town and like any artery if they fail it's ha it has huge environmental impacts on everything and other hab habitats will fail. Nature does not need us, but we need nature, and we need to act now, not later. Thank you very much for your time. Councillor Dawson. Thank you, Lord Mayor. I'd like to move that the matter be referred to the Director of Communities and Environment for consideration, uh, in consultation with the relevant Exec Board member. Councillor Cole. Councillor Cox? Sorry, second. <laughs> Those for? Those against? Any abstentions? That's been carried. 